Oh, hey there. Caught me in zoomed out mode. I've just won the dice roll, obviously. I've been told that my opponent hasn't actually opened any hand traps, so this could be a good solitaire series. So we'll give uh, my opponent the cup. Just doing a quick solitaire episode on Gem Knights, hopefully to show you guys kind of like what the deck can do. There are a few combo tutorials out there, which, you know, I've had a look at. I mean, why wouldn't you? But uh, let's see what we can do. So this is a very interesting and probably standard-esque hand. It's nice that we've opened the Rescue Rabbit, but we've also got something that will mean that our opponent can't stop us with a hand trap. So even if they did open that hand trap, we've, uh, we've got prevention from them that's disrupting us. So we're going to activate the Instant Fusion. I think Instant Fusion is actually even, maybe even better than Called by the Grave, um, just because it puts a body on board and that can clog a little bit but you know I think the offset for that is it disrupts the hand trap and it also is a body so it's great so we're gonna go with Thousand Eyes, Millennium Eyes Restrict should I say Thousand Eyes Restrict that was the standard I suppose but Millennium Eyes is great I think it's even good going second as well it's just it's just an all-round good card it's also got a reprint fairly recently as well so I managed to pick some up rather than spending the 50 quid or whatever it was before so from there, we're going to go into our Rescue Rabbit. So Rescue Rabbit's going to banish itself. There we go. Just re-educating myself on... Because Rescue Cat is the one that tributes and Rescue Rabbit's the one that banishes. So I think here, because we've not got any normal monsters, the best bet is to go for Lapis, because that gets us into our Lady Lapis Lazule. That's useful. So at some point we're going to need to try and get that crystal rose out of our hand as well. But uh, so I think first of all we're just going to link straight away into the phantom quartz. Oh dear, I'm, I've, uh, we're going to have to stick to outside the zones here because I'm I'm playing way too high. It's a little bit sad. It's the downside of having an old mat, I suppose. So from there we're going to activate. Phantom Quartz's effect, and I think here, probably the best thing to go for would be an Obsidian, because that'll get us back Gem Knight Lapis. Um, ooh, at some point we are going to have to get to... Um, we are going to have to get to... Curious Light Swarm Dominion, which isn't going to be that easy, because we need to get to Block Dragon. There must be a way of doing that. Monster reborn, so we could link spider, but we need um, we need a thingy in play. We need um, a tourmaline in play. Maybe lapsus wasn't the right thing to go for. So I think while we're here, we'll activate Gemini Fusion. We'll fuse away the Obsidian and the Crystal Rose. That's going to get us. Sephronite, because thankfully Crystal Rose is a light monster. That'll give us a normal summon, an additional normal summon. And Obsidian is going to special summon back one. So we're going to special summon back Lapis, I think. Well, our options are fairly limited, let's say. So that seems like a reasonable, reasonable punt. So we've actually collected almost all the requirements to get to Dominion. I think. I want to try to get an, my additional normal summon off now because we're about to lose our Sephiroth. Although we could not have reborn it back. So sorry, there's uh, there's all manner of things that are going on here. So I think I'm actually going to get rid of Gem Knight Lap Lapis to go for the Link Spider here. So we've now got a Rock, a Cyverse, and a Fairy. So I think from there. We could shuffle in back three, but I don't think that's the right move yet. So I think from here we're going to get rid of Link Spider, Phantom Quartz, and so how might and we we'll get to, get to that Curious? So Curious is pretty pretty key. If you can't get to the Gallant Granite, then Curious is your next best to get to get your Blocky Boy, and Blocky Boy is pretty pretty crooks. So I'll send the Block Dragon with Dominion's effect. And then from there we're going to get to excavate three cards from the top of our deck, which hopefully help us out. 
A lot of the time it's good if you, you know, just get rid of it, some earths. So let's offer our opponent social distance cut. Then one. Ooh, that's nice. That's not so nice. It's fine. It's it's okay. I think is the uh, long and short of it. So from there we can banish some stuff. So I'll banish the Phantom Quartz, the Link Spider, and I think an Obsidian to splash some black with the Block Dragon. Lucky Dragon. Yeah, yeah, that seems reasonable. So from there we're going to link off the Block Dragon and the Curious. And we're going to go for Cross Sheep. So Cross Sheep's great because it's going to give us a special summon and that's if a monster is summoned to its own, so we can actually trigger it just by using the Monster Reborn, which is going to be quite useful. So we'll Monster Reborn, and we'll get back our oh, Block Dragon searches. I think, we'll, uh, I think we'll take the opportunity to search there. So we'll go Obsidian. Oh, actually, I think we're... Uh, we're going to have to go a weird route because, uh, we're, well, we've already got kind of like a Crystal Rose in place, so we don't really need to search. So I think I'm going to search a Lazuli and maybe a Tourmaline. I'm, I'm not even sure we really need the extra normal summon, really, because we're going to special summon back here with uh, Cross Sheep. So, right, so we'll, we'll search those three cards. Pretty key. At some point, we are going to need to go back into uh, Phantom Quartz to get some more monsters on board. So we've, we've burned our Monster Reborn. So we can Cross Sheep and we'll get back that sweet Crystal Rose. So Crystal Rose's effect activates, and we're going to send the Lazule to the graveyard. Lazule will trigger, and that's going to add us back the Lapis. Then we can banish the Lazule to add the Gemlight Fusion. We can then get rid of the Crystal Rose, because it's now treated as Lazule and the Saffronite, to go for another Phantom Quartz. I think we'll pay our second thousand life points here so shuffle in three so we'll shuffle in the phantom quartz the gem knight obsidian and the Zule. is that the right move i'm actually now before we do that before we do that i think i'm going to banish the saffronite to push some back the crystal rose that feels like a feels like a good move and then we can shuffle back in the saffronite the Zule, and the phantom quartz to go for master diamond so then we can dump again with Crystal Rose because it, it, the, the once per turn effect for Crystal Rose is the special summon, not the dump. The non once per turn dump is exceedingly good. So here we're going to get another plus from Crystal Rose, and you can see we're we're in we're in we're in huge huge plus here from 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 this play. So we need to get out uh, Lady Lapsis Lazule. So. Here, it's, we're gonna, we, there's no point using Obsidian because we can't special summon. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to use Gem Knight Fusion. We're going to use Gem Knight Fusion for using Lazule and Lapsis to go for Lapsis, Lazule. What's going on there? Oh, I've banished that. That's right. So there we go. Right, okay. And now you can see we're in, we're in Burn Town now. So that Lazule will activate, adding back the Lapsis. So we've got, we've got loads of... Of materials to, to, to finish off a combo we've absolutely guaranteed victory here so lady lapsus lazuli's effect will go off we will send the other lady lapsus lazuli that will be 3000 damage we'll then activate master diamonds effect banish the lapsus lazuli that's in the graveyard that's effect becomes lady lapsus lazuli so we can send another do we have a final lazuli i hope we do no, we don't. Oh, that's sad, isn't it? Well, it might as well be a, a tourmaline, maybe. I don't really. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. I think is the is the point. So from there, we're going to banish Lazule from the graveyard to add back the Gem Knight Fusion. From there, we need to link away the Master Diamond, and we also need to link away. Sorry, we need to link away the Lady Lapsus Lazule and keep the Master Diamond on board. So this needs to go in Graveyard in order to succeed in our combo. So that goes to Grave. And Nightmare Unicorn will come out in a, very, in a play very akin to a Spiral play. So we'll discard 
the Gemini Fusion that will put the Master Diamond back into our extra deck. From there, we can then banish whatever we want, basically. We'll banish the... Nope, not that. Anything but that. <laughs> we'll banish the, the Zule to add back the Gem Knight Fusion. And then we can play Gem Knight Fusion again, this time with Obsidian and two others. Obsidian's actually going to go off this time. So that's in the grave. Special summon the Master Diamond back. Probably not the Link Pointer. But it doesn't matter because... Obsidian is going to activate Special Summoning back our Tourmaline. Master Diamond is going to activate. We're going to send, banish the remaining laps, Lady Lapsus Azule. So activate its effect to dump another Gem Knight monster, which we're fast running out of Gem Knights here, to burn for the final, well, a final 3,000. 3, so we've done 9,000 damage there. But you can see we've chunked into our, a major uh, portion of our extra deck and also our deck in this combo and we've also kind of rid ourselves of all resources but you can kind of get a feel and a flair for, for how the deck performs and also how easy and varied the combo is although I did open um, Rescue Rabbit here so I suppose that's, that's maybe a little bit misleading. Anyway, I hope you made it through the 12 minutes of combo. Thanks very much for watching an episode of the Solitaire series. Be sure to check out the others that are on the channel and the deck profiles on the channel for whoever's interested. Thanks for watching.